It's 1841 and little Dean Woodside, 15 year old Kate, daughter of Catherine Drew, the forest poetess, is getting everything ready for a very special tea. I'm making the tea before mother wakes up. Want it all ready, proper surprise. Nice pot of tea, fresh bread, fresh butter. And I've even made cake. Oh, it's a special day, you know, for our mum, my mother, Catherine Drew, her own book. A collection of poems on the forest of Dean and its neighbourhood by Catherine Drew of Little Dean Woodside, Gloucestershire. It's published at the request of several friends. And to think, mother never went to school. Not really. Nine days, she says. Nine days at school and that's all. Can you imagine that? It got her started. But it was her father really that taught her to read and write. And that was enough. Mother remembers the old days in her poems. When there was nothing here. Just a few free miners and people scratching about for a living. She misses that and harks on about it in her poems. Of course, a lot's changed since then. We've got a proper school now. That's where I went, learnt my alphabet and everything. All those changes she's seen in the forest. That is what Mother's poems are about. She's not too keen on city life coming here. Musical halls. And don't get her started on chartists and votes for everyone. Even women. That would set her right off. But me. I wouldn't mind that one bit. Yes, all these changes she's seen, that and the trees, the birds, the animals and her good Christian sense of right and wrong, that is what Mother's poems are about. I think people will still be reading her poems in 10 years. 20 years time. Kate! Coming mother! Catherine Drew's 1841 collection of poems was republished in 1904 and again in 2002. A remarkable record of her times. Her poems are still being read to this day.